Well, hello everybody. Uh, got my new main breaker panel in and getting ready to install a RCCB, which is a remote control circuit breaker. It's a main circuit breaker. And so anyway, the uh, I will be replacing this unit right here which I've already loosened the nuts for, and uh, taking this breaker out, and it's kind of hard to do with one hand while I'm showing you, but the uh, um, pretty cool panel. Now this is home line, it's not QO. My home has QO, but there are some loads. Uh, this box is gonna be mounted on the outside of the house, and uh, there are some loads that uh, I do want to run off mains power and uh, I'll be able to hook those loads directly up uh, to this uh, main service panel unit and then uh, uh, for my grid tied inverters I'll be able to tie them into this section as well and then my uh, service mains panel that I have three load centers already coming off of, uh, the uh, I will be using those as load using that panel as a load panel, and the units I'm talking about, or the uh, I have two electric convection ovens. Uh, they're not commercial, they're domestic, but they're electric, and uh, I wouldn't want to run those off of uh, inverter power. And uh, I have a little uh, hot water heater, uh, same thing. So anyway, the uh, uh, this just simply lifts up and slides back. And then I'll be replacing that with the remote circuit breaker. So remotely, I'll be able to lock out the mains from the meter base. And I'll just scope this out. The, uh, uh, this will end up being 36 inches off the ground to give a 48-49 uh, inch height. Uh, off the gray. It's supposed to be uh, 40 between 48 and 50 inches. So if I set that at 36 off the grade Then that'll be set right now. This isn't a top mount unit. So I am going to have to gooseneck it and uh, uh, Come around with my mains But some of the features that are cool has a pass-through up underneath it and uh, the um, service will come in from this side right here and neutral L1 excuse me neutral L1 L2 and the box is is grounded okay and then I'll have my 200 amp remote service breaker there and then I'll have the loads I was describing, such as my ovens and other things. And then on through the top of it, uh, this is actually the the uh, the top of the panel. This is the bottom. So and I'll be able to uh, switch those loads, run my inverter and everything off that, and then be able to lock the mains out uh, if I choose to. So, kind of a unique configuration there, and well, my total disconnect will all be, my solder and everything be facilitated by this panel. Uh, came very well uh, assembled, and the uh, unit just slides up there, and it's kind of interesting. The uh, um, when that locks down right there, 
there's a screw that goes up underneath this meter uh, when they install it. And then this screw right here has a wire lock. So the way that they uh, uh, secure it is they run their safety wire through there, through there, and through there. And that way they know it's been tampered with if, if it has indeed been tampered. And then, uh, again, it's hard to do with one hand, but the, the meter ring that they use, let's see if I can get it to come off. Well, it's hard to do with one hand. Anyway, there's a screw up underneath here that you can get to when you take this piece of paper out that locks the whole thing down and secure. And so this is going to be my new service panel and for my mask and everything. And since I'm having to pull out a permit to get everything done, have my electrician that has all the insurance and everything uh, pull the permit and uh, I'll be doing most of the work and then uh, she'll inspect it for me and, and be good to go. But that's the way I'm going at it. And I was really surprised I was able to get this unit very, very reasonable. And But that's going to be my main uh, service panel. And then I'm going to use my uh, uh, load panel in the house, which is right there. Uh, that's going to become instead of a service panel, it's going to become a load center and uh, uh, that will fix that. So I'm not going to replace that. I'm going to leave that right there. This will go on the outside on the other side, masked up in the time I uh, 200 amp uh, service into that. So anyway, that's what I'm into this evening. And hope you guys are having fun because we are. And uh, I'll see you next trip. Love y'all. Bye.